And as the protests against the derogatory article reached, the authorities have asked an under-15 Lankan cricket team to leave Chennai for security reasons. The cricket team arrived in Chennai to play the JM Haroon cricket tournament. However, in the wake of intensifying protests against the article, the police urged them to leave, citing security reasons. They left for Colombo this morning. The under-15 private tournament is scheduled to be held from the 4th to the 7th of this month. Sir, uh, we have been organizing this for the past eight, eight years. This is 22nd tournament. We have already given letter to the city police commissioner and all the top police bosses, stating that this uh, Pakistan, Bangladesh, Sri Lanka, Malaysia and all other teams we have invited and they are coming here. Due to the reasons for visa, Bangladesh and uh, Pakistan couldn't able to succeed in that, couldn't able to come. Only Malaysia and Sri Lanka has come. Last night, uh, forcefully, the team has been... Uh, no, what was forcefully? Why force was applied? No, uh, the, I will not say force. The police people came and requested, we cannot give security due to various other reasons. So they requested us to cooperate with them. We have cooperated with them. Uh, yeah, that was unfortunate. That, um, I think the Sri Lankan government uh, issued a statement yesterday about regarding this uh, the website issue and um, uh, uh, that has been uh, uh, sent it to the, the Indian government. And regarding about this uh, issue uh, with the under 15 cricket team, uh, the sport uh, has been dragged into politics. I think that is that should not be there because uh, the sport and politics are two different areas. So I hope uh, uh, people will calm down soon and. Uh, uh, to separate these two uh, from politics and politics and sports. Yeah, the, the sports person can't do much when the politics is involved, but as long as um, uh, what we can do is make sure that uh, it's not uh, dragging together. Right. So that's the unfortunate thing. So I hope uh, um, the cricket is a sport and everyone loves that game and sports, um, uh, India and Sri Lanka. We love, love sport, so uh, no one wants to drag this uh, into politics. So I hope uh, this, this, this will be solved uh, soon and um, uh, sport uh, remain uh, uh, independent much as possible. That was a bit unfortunate, like I said in the earlier. So uh, we will have to, um, if there are any issues, we need to talk, uh, uh, we need to have a dialogue and we have to come to solution because without talk we don't know. So if something happens, and uh, I think uh, we'll have to correct from our part, and also, um, like I said earlier, uh, we should not drag uh, 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 the sport into this uh, politics. So it should be independent, and I hope uh, the both countries have realized that, and uh, we need to discuss, and uh, we'll have to uh, solve this issue fast. No, this is the, uh, the first time last two years it has happened, and, and due to... Uh, in our country, the war was there for the last 30 years, and we, uh, the government has stopped the war. And uh, it's totally different uh, uh, situation in Sri Lanka. Now it has been really good, um, the security wise in Sri Lanka. So, uh, the uh, uh, little little things and effect uh, not India, only in Chennai. So, uh, our government is having a, a political dialogue, and when, when we were playing, we have been uh, played so long, about 20 years of my cricket injury, we never had any issues. Right. But even though uh, we avoid uh, uh, international games in Chennai, though, even during that uh, right. uh, uh, period. So uh, not, nothing has been major, but these, these are the little issues we have been uh, facing at the moment. I think it should be uh, 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 political things and we have a dialogue and we need